Hey there, Kuroi here. Let's talk Eminence in Shadow episode 4. Pretty good episode. I was kind of at the edge of the seat for half the episode. Mostly because people kept ringing the doorbell at my house, but I knew what was going to happen. Just didn't remember much of the details. So I was, okay, now I remember this. Cool, cool. Some action is coming now. And every couple of minutes, I was like, oh no, it's going to end here and we won't see Shadow in action. And then finally, yes, we see Shadow appear, but it ends there in a cliffhanger. Damn it. <laughs> so first we see someone from the cult is doing some experiment with Alexia's blood. I like how she's, oh, that happened to you. Poor you. Yeah, I get it. She's really just going with the guy trying to get some info of him or at least trying not to get him mad also she kind of protects the other experimented the guy was kicking on her so she called him to take his attention off the other person then we have steed doing the mob thing <laughs> getting tortured we meet alexia's sister funny how she has a file on Sid and has a photo of Alexia stabbing the food into his mouth. I love how there is some noise outside, and there she is, the broken sister. <laughs> she gets crazy when it's about Sid. They need a couple of girls to restrain her. And then this other chick who later I remember is Rose Oriana. I like Sid's sister. She really needs a badass moment. So they release Sid after five days, I think. Fucking these guys. Thankfully, those guys are with the cult. Because if they were just knights, I would fucking hate them even more. I like how Sid on the way back says, I could heal myself pretty easy, but that's not what a mob would do. <laughs> and the guys there that are following him, dude, can you be a little more obvious? Sid gets back to his room and Alpha is there waiting with some info and some plans. And Sid, please, <laughs> he thinks that the group lives their lives somewhere and sometimes come to play with him. That's actually less likely than what he imagines with the cult. And what a nice waifu. Deadly, beautiful, and she brought him a burger. <laughs> what more can you ask? Then we have Shadow preparing the room, and that was something. He has the wine, the art, furniture, expensive, vintage, rare stuff, all bought with the money from the bandit killing and his other job as Pochi. <laughs> I really like those smooth moves with the wine and the glass, and then with the envelope. He does some sweet move, and he makes the glass appear and takes the paper out of the envelope. So Shadow starts moving. First thing, get rid of these idiots, while Beta is there behind him writing the Chronicles of Shadow. <laughs> Shadow Garden also is doing their part. Delta going nuts, slashing buildings and all. Meanwhile, Alexia is hanging in there, kind of. And this guy, what an idiot. He gives the blood and whatever to the other experimented to boost it, most likely, and what? You thought you could just stay there? Funny how Alexia even says to him, you shouldn't do that, and after the power-up, he gets stabbed in the face. <laughs> yeah, that's what you get. She even told you that. So, Monster Kun frees Alexia. She did kind of protected her before, and didn't look down on her, so Monster Kun returned the favor. Nice. Alexia is looking for a way out and gets found by the betrothed son. <laughs> and he's a bad guy. I like how she goes, Oh, thank God you're a bad guy. <laughs> Always thought there was something wrong with you. And I was right. <laughs> so she tries to fight him, but this guy is probably powered up a little and she's been prisoner for a week. So she's weak. She does some cool technique manages to injure him, but it ends with a punch to the face. Oof. <laughs> Looks like she won't be escaping soon, but there he is. 
Shadow appears with his background music and all. <laughs> Wouldn't surprise me if he has some recording playing somewhere. He does control the wind sometimes to be more epic. So that's pretty much the episode. Pretty calm, but entertaining, funny. Setting up things for next episode. And there we'll have some fight. Um, that's all I got for now. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, leave a like, a comment if you want. And see you in the next one.